picking someone uh, th that you really, really yeah. like, like David, um, and, and then spending a lot of money to yeah. look like them, um, you've got to sort of have the bone structure, yeah. the, 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 the bone structure to, to work yeah. on, because it's going to be very hard yeah. for you to look l like him. Like, obviously, like, I know I don't look like him, you know what I mean? I'm not that stupid. But I got a long way to go to get my goals to look like him. How close do you reckon you're going to be able to get? I don't know, but it's easier, like another 30 grand, because it's going to like cost some money, like operation to look like him. Well, what have you had done so far then? Um, I've had cheek fillers. I've had filler in my, my chin there. Um, what else? I've had my eyebrow at HD lift. Um, what else? Oh, my, I had my lips, my border. I've had my teeth done. Um, oh, I have tanning injections once a month. I do try and get his skin tone. What um, was that? A tanning injection? Yeah. Do you not worry about that? All these sort of things that you're doing to yourself. You're you're a young lad. You know that you're putting all these things into your body. Do you worry about how that's going to affect your health long term? Yeah, I understand that. But if I I'm doing something to make myself happy, and say in four years time something happens to me, it's my own fault, and I know it is. But along all I'm bothered about, as long as I stay happy. Mm. Mm. Oh, and that's the most and important stop. thing. You know, yeah. if, you're, if you're doing something and it's making you happy, then then sort of fair enough. I mean, yeah. there, are, there are other aspects of paying for it, which we'll come uh, to in just a moment. But Dave, David, of course, is a honed sportsman. Yeah. You know, what about the body? The body, from obviously, I'm not slim like him, I ain't got the six pack, but I do want a gastric band. And you've been to the doctors asking for a gastric yeah. band. And in your words, you said the doctors have kicked you out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And for what reason? Because I kept on going and they were saying you want a certain weight, you have to be high, you know what I mean? And I was saying I really need this, you know what I mean? It would change my life. I had problems all my life with weight. And OK, I'm not just doing it to like, get the quicker way to get lose weight. I'm doing it. I've tried every diet in the book to lose weight. I've tried every exercise and I can't do it. So I need the gastric band to help me. But when I have that done, I need to still exercise and eat alpha. Do you, do you ever think about, because you sort of hear all these people that, you know, they feel very unhappy and they think it's the weight that's the reason they're unhappy and then they lose the yeah. weight and then eventually they look in the mirror and they suddenly realise that actually it hasn't changed anything, they're yeah. still unhappy underneath. Do you ever worry that after doing all of this, spending all this money, putting your health at risk, that actually maybe you should just work on, on you and, and learning to really love the person that you are now? Mm, I know what you mean, but not really. I'm up there looking like David Beckham, being like David Beckham. I want his lifestyle. That's, that's, so, uh, that's yeah. an interesting thing to say as well, because David Beckham has earned the lifestyle that yeah. he lives because he is an international sportsman and has been at the absolute top of yeah. his game. Um, how, how can you... Cos a lot of the meltdown on social media over the weekend was the fact that you're unemployed, yeah. you're spending your benefits on... That's the Looking thing, like I just this. want to confirm, I ain't spent one bit of my money on my benefits. I've took out loans and I'm in debt. But how are you, you going to pay that loans? back? Loans. Yeah, you've got, you're £19,000 in debt, aren't you? That's why I haven't paid for them on benefits, yeah. so I can't... So how are you going to pay that back? And if I you said you still need £30,000 to continue this... I don't know. <laughs> I do not know. Isn't that just going to make you sadder? No. The fact that you you don't look like David Beckham and you're incredibly in debt. No, I know I don't look like David Beckham at the minute, but at the moment I feel happy, I feel amazing about myself. Yeah. I mean, I'm in the best place ever I've been these last past year. Yeah. Well, let's let's talk about that lifestyle because as I said, you know, we know why David Beckham lives the lifestyle yeah. that he does. Um, you've said, I want to be on the friends list of Nicki Minaj, Beyonce, Drake and Katie Price. One day Simon Cowell will be picking up the phone to me. Yeah. What's your talent? How are you gonna how are you gonna earn that sort of lifestyle? What are you gonna do? I don't know. I'll do anything, but I believe I don't I know this sounds very big Ed and, and like cocky if you know what I mean, but all my life I've already known I've been different. I ain't never fit in anywhere, go at school anywhere, and I believe my like I should be in TV or acting or like yourself presenting something because I never fit in anywhere. So and is that why you're struggling to, to find a job then? Because you're not happy to just take a yeah. job that comes along. You're yeah. holding out for for something yeah. on screen or in the media in yeah, some way. Something like that. Yeah. But but I, I, it's the thing I people ask me a lot. Ask us a lot. Yeah. You know, how do I get into it? What do I do? What you can't get into this game just because you want to be famous. Like, I don't want just like stuff chucked to me. You know You've what I mean? You've got to be good at it. I want to be good at it. Yeah, I believe I can. But I want to work my absolute butt off yeah. to get there. You know what I mean? 
I'm not one of them people where I just want stuff chucked at me. I want to honestly work my absolutely butt off to get my goal. Mm. And, and, and my, my concern is that, yeah. is that uh, to pick up on what Holly was saying, is that you've, you've set yourself such a massive goal, yeah. way, way off in the distance, um, that, that you're never going to get to that level of happiness until, until you love yourself. I do love myself how I am now, you know what I mean? But I just want to look like David Beckham. Like, who don't, you know what I mean? Like, no one can say David Beckham is ugly or is not attractive, you know what I mean? Even people who's not a fan of him, mm. they would say it, you know what I mean? Well, look, uh, what, what to say? I mean, it's not really saying <laughs> good luck with it, you know, just, yeah. just look after you, I think, is all I want to leave you with today. Yeah. But thank you for, for coming in and Thank you for having me. For more of the same, just click here. And don't forget, you can subscribe for even more of these amazing videos exclusive to our channel. Now, at 71 stone, if you reach your goal, how would you get to the food without help? There's plenty of men who would love to be in Sid's position, so I, I would... I have people message me every day <laughs> of well, just about, you're so lucky, you're so lucky.